probably gonna make some tea. Mug of the day. Tea of the day. It says vanilla chai if you don't know how to read the cursive because you know what? Someday nobody's gonna be able to read cursive except for like anthropologists and historians. Isn't that nuts? Not really, but I hope y'all like my jammies. These are my favorite jammies, I think. Ah. It's Saturday. Um, it's about 9 a.m. Yeah, 9, 10 a.m. I love when the clock counts at me. 9, 10? Yeah, I know. Um, you do scoops of sugar in the tea, and then you pause the recording until you're doing something interesting. Before I go, actually, I will say that, um, we'll just consider this part of my gratitude journaling, even though I'm not going to write it down, but I'm grateful for how cool the, um, bubbles that settle in the top of your teacup are. Whether you're drinking out of like a mug or a, I don't know, tessiography is something that I never got into necessarily yet, but I totally believe my fortune could be interpreted through fucking coffee beans and tea leaves because I drink that hot leaf juice all the time. I'm addicted to it. Okay, love you. See you later. back with an almost forgotten part of the morning routine because I have a morning routine now because I love myself I'm trying I'm putting you guys in the kitchen because it's where the best lighting is but I'm not gonna be irresponsible and stupid enough to put them on the sink so here we are We have a lot to do today. But our face is iced and debuffed. So we're good. Hey y'all, I'm still here. I just had to slash got to drive my boyfriend to his little cookout with his boys. I'm very pink today, but the lighting's poor, so you cannot really tell. I'm watching Nana, because it expires off of Hulu this Friday. Um, I've done dishes. I started some laundry. Gonna get that done. I got some new hair clips. I don't really know how to use them yet, but I like them. Okay. See y'all in a little bit, maybe. I would like to vlog some cleaning today, but I've been procrastinating and I have to do homework too. Peace out, scouts. I just got a package delivered um, that I'm very excited to open. So I decided to open it with you. Because most of my life isn't this exciting. Um, I ordered a couple things from Kitsch, which is like an eco-friendly, vegan, cruelty-free hair care brand. Oh my goodness. Oh, the box smells so good. Okay, minimal packaging. One way that you know that they are like... As far as I can tell, they're not greenwashed and they are actually an eco-friendly brand. So I got three things. I already had a couple like sample things from them that I really liked, so I decided to splurge and order these online. I don't shop for myself too often. Um, so, this 
is a shower cap that I got. I've never had a shower cap before, but it looks super cute. And I also got, I've tried this as a sample and the sample is decent sized, but I'm about to run out of it. So uh, castor oil, nourishing solid shampoo bar. Excuse me. It says that it is good for 100 washes and I wash my hair like once a week so that's a decent amount of time for me. And I also got these recycled nylon hair ties which are super thick and super soft and I love them already. Let me just get them out of the packaging. Oh my goodness. <sighs> they make me... Okay, I have pretty tiny wrists, but they make my wrists feel extra tiny, which I don't know why I like. Okay, for comparison, these are the elastics I've been using, and I like them a lot, but, um... Ah, these are so great. I'm just gonna put them all on my wrist for now because they feel really cozy. Y'all remember um, in the early 2000s slash 90s slash before that, um, I think it started probably in the 80s, <clears throat> when sweatbands, those like uh, terry cloth or like, I don't know, towel type material, stretchy sweatbands were popular to wear on your wrists and on your... This looks ridiculous. Um... I'm gonna leave this in the box until I'm done with the sample, which will probably be like two more washes maybe. But I'm gonna go ahead and open this because I'm really excited about it. I've never used a shower cap before for some... Well, I mean, I've used them like a couple odd times to like dye my hair and do shit like that. Um, but this is a satin lined flexi shower cap for fine curly or straight hair. I have fine wavy hair, I think. I don't know. It's mostly straight, but when I take good care of it, it's wavy. Oh, oh my goodness. It's so cute. It's even got, okay, so it's got, <laughs> this is strange. I didn't expect that. Um, it's got like wire lined. I'm glad it has instructions now on the back of the box because this is like not what I expected it to look like, but um I'm not going to try to put it on right now. I'll put it on later. So, step 1, pull hood completely over your head like a spa headband, place elastic at hairline, ensure stitch line wire stitch line and wire are at the back of your head. Then pull hood up, gather hair inside. Okay, so you can see these little, like, graphics. So close, once your hair is gathered inside, close opening by rolling the back of the hood toward your head. I'm guessing against the wire. Keep rolling until the hood fits securely. Bring the ends of the wire closer together for a secure fit. Now your style is protected. Hop in the shower. Nice. Okay, so this is for, like, styled hair. I don't really style my hair much, but, um, like I said, I wash my hair once a week, and obviously I shower more than once a week. Uh, so my boyfriend suggested, because I'm always, like, trying to keep my head, I, I don't know. I don't usually wear a shower cap. I just put my hair in a bun, and then if it gets wet while I'm in the shower, I'm like, well, damn. Um, but he was like, why don't you just get a shower cap? And I was like, okay, whatever, you write. So now I have a shower cap. It's gonna be so cute on my head. It's gonna match these jammies. I think I'm done vlogging for the day. This is almost 10 minutes. I'm having a good day though. I hope you are too. This was really fun. Ah, I'm so excited. I got all my elastics and a shower cap. So sorry for the singing, except I'm not. Um, peace.
Peace out, scouts of all genders. Bye.